don't want our youth to be put in that debt. We want them to succeed. Close to $40,000. That's how much Brittany Cullison said it would have cost her to earn 45 credits elsewhere. She estimates she saved herself and her parents more than $37,000 through dual enrollment. They didn't realize how big of a deal this was going to be. Brittany asked professors not to let anyone know she was still in high school, but classmates could have figured it out if they had just seen her mom drop her off on campus. Yeah, I was getting out of my car and I'm like, oh my gosh, nobody else's mom is dropping them off. I felt like I should have had like a little lunch bag or something. <laughs> Brittany says she took the college level courses while still in high school and playing soccer and holding down a full time job. I like to be busy, so it helps. The coordinators of the program say the benefits are endless, not just in saving dollars, but in terms of getting ahead. High school and college are very different. The transition um, can be a challenging one at times. So the classroom environment is different. So they need to build upon certain skills that are going to make them successful, not only in the classroom, but also successful in the college atmosphere as well. I feel like it really set me forward for college. Like I'm not scared at all to go in. Brittany's graduating from high school this month and is going to major in nursing at your college in Pennsylvania, where an impressed professor embraced her 45 credits through dual enrollment and asked her about the program. You're educating the educator. Yeah, exactly. Switching roles. <laughs> in Gloucester County, Michael Hill, NJTV News.